Hello, ho, ho, Merry Christmas, everyone. Welcome back to my channel. I'm Too Breezy, and today we're celebrating a Christmas extravaganza. So we'll be exploring two maps and two add-ons. How exciting is that? So as always, the links to the add-ons and maps will be in the description as well as the tutorial on how to download. So let's get into the first map. The first map is Gingerbread House Creation. It's been built in uh, basic vanilla. And as you can see, they've done a fabulous job. So we'll go over and explore the Christmas tree first. You've got your little presents. Doesn't give you anything, unfortunately. Um, another, no, still nothing. Uh, and a chest, a, a really cleverly built uh, tree. Um, big presents, uh, which unfortunately still has nothing in it, but it's Minecraft, so I'm sure you'll survive. So wonderful. So they've got uh, uh, glass, gold blocks, uh, ender rods as candles, which works really well. Um, painting frames, and they've made a star on top, which is a really good star for Minecraft, I think. Uh, very clever. I will keep that in mind for my own builds at home. Um, well, Minecraft home anyway. So we'll wander up this path and check out this house. So the house has uh, <laughs> a slippery front porch. So just watch yourself on that. Um, double door to keep the heat in. Um, you've got your mistletoe above the doorway. So you can get in a sneaky kiss. Uh, big fireplace, uh, side tables or with ender rods as candles. Gosh, those ender rods work really well as candles. Chests, there's nothing in them. I've already checked. Um, dragon egg, uh, whoops. <laughs> dragon eggs now gone. Um, stockings hung by the chimney with care. What a really brilliant idea. I would never have thought of that. Stealing that also, thank you very much. And we go over here. Um, you got your cookie above the door, which signifies the kitchen area. You've got your uh, gross purple water that everyone has in their sinks at home. Uh, just some nice little decorations. Oh, there's actually something in this chest. Obviously, I didn't check this one before. And I will I'll just have a sip of that. Some eggnog. So that's your lovely little kitchen area. That's all you need. It's just a cook tea. You're not going to spend your life in there. Yep, close the door. Little seating area. Your books. And that's pretty much the downstairs area. And you go um, up a level. Up, yep. Um, and you got uh, your little bedroom here with bunk beds and a cupboard. And oh, that's where the dragon egg went. <laughs> well, there you go. You got some more storage up here. Ah, oh, cookies. They must be for Santa. So, dibs top with bunk. Top bunk's the best. Unless you've got a low ceiling, in which case top bunks hurt. Alright, I'll show you this uh, area in a minute. We'll just go upstairs here. So you go up here and you've got your... Oh, I fell down. You've got your like a little a balcony area where you can overlook your um, dining room. An amazing view. I love snowy biomes because... I mean, it only snows in certain parts of Australia, so I live my snowy dreams through the Minecraft world because I don't live anywhere near snow, unfortunately. And so you've got this amazing dining table, huge, big enough for a family feast. You've got your plates, your, your cake, um, the most important Christmas favour yet, and your <laughs> really well-designed chairs. What a great dining area. I wish I had a dining area like that at home. And you go outside and that's pretty much it for the gingerbread house. Uh, an amazing build and if you want it for your Christmas um, place, just get going. 
onto the description. And once you've had enough time uh, exploring a gingerbread house here, just want to relax, head over to the Christmas theme park because nothing says Christmas more than a theme park. So you've got your little parking lot. You come through to your ticket gate and uh, I'm not going to pay. So you have permission to blow up the map afterwards. <laughs> Thank you so much. That's going to be the best part of this map. Um, make sure to look around for a secret something or others. Also, don't blah, blah, blah. A shout out on my channel. Okay, Shadowblader21, I will leave your link in the description below. Thank you for building this map. It's amazing. I love that you've got rubbish bins. Keeping the world clean. I like it. That's, whoa, that's a big roller coaster. Wouldn't go on that in real life. But uh, it's not real life. It's uh, Minecraft. And it's Christmas. The viewing coaster. It's just a ride. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> All right. Let's go for a ride on the viewing coaster. Let's get... Oh, God, you got to put effort in. That counts me out for any roller coaster. Oh, my gosh. Look at that. And I can see why it's called the viewing coaster now. Yet an awesome view of the theme park that they've created. Gosh, some hours must have gone into this. Kudos to them. I do not have the patience for this. Nor the ability, if we're being honest. Oh my gosh, this is a big roller coaster. And down we go. Wee! Ah! Ah! Woo! Thought we were going to crash there. Look at that cake build. I just want to eat it. TNT, Christmas tree, candy canes, and we're still going. And, oh, a big apple. I assume that's where you buy food. And we're still going. And we're still going. And back up again. <laughs> oh my goodness. What a ride. And we're finished. Well, that was pretty trick. I would never have gone that in the real life. Little exit signs. A lot of uh, thoughts gone into this map. Very clever. I do recommend you jump on and have a look. Let's see what else we've got. We've got Connect 4. <laughs> That's sick. Okay, let's give this a run. How do we do it? Oh, they've got a reset button. Nice. Oh, concrete powder. Clever. So you just... Oh, that's so cool. Definitely a map to use with friends. Don't like what they're doing? Just reset it. You can't lose. Oh, prizes. You can have your concrete back in there. What else have we got? We've got... Oh, that's your rubbish bin. Oh, nice. You can have my minecart. Oh, or not, I'll have it back. Have my minecart. Have my minecart. Take my minecart. Oh my gosh. No, I'm not leaving. There we go. I was not leaving until I'd put my rubbish in the bin. Teen taste leaf. <laughs> nice. Right, so you just jump in there and bomb each other. <coughs> What's this big tower? Oh, snow spleef. So you go up and up and up some more. You may need more than one. Hmm. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, so it's got different levels. Oh, right. So it's like a proper game of spleef. Oh, that's awesome. Down and down. I can see me losing this in, you know, 30 seconds flat. Down, down, down. Oh, and you end up in lava. I would really like to play this with a friend. I would really like to give a go at murdering them. I mean, in the Christmas spirit. Let's make them a Christmas spirit. All right. I didn't have to get 
out. So I'll just break this down and go out. Here we go. All right, let's see what else they've got. They've got a um, huge statue over there. 50% off sale. Yeah, boy, this is all about. Oh, yes. Who doesn't love a sale? Weapons, armor, and more. Two emeralds? That's a bargain. Oh. <laughs> Can't get them in creative, I don't think. Let's give it another go. Give me some booties. No. Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. So you've got um, your armor, your weapons. They're all reasonably priced. And in the prizes, you can win uh, emeralds. So if you're playing this with a friend, it would be very... Uh, fun to win the prizes, win the emeralds, and get the better armor. Oh, there's a Dantanium statue. Oh, wow. Um, yeah, and play the TNT spleef and stuff like that with the you know with the better armor. That would be really fun. Gosh, there's just so much to this map. There's a Jim's cute little Christmas tree. Okay, fair enough. Bouncy castles. What's this? Oh, I just broke it. Pat love Jen. Oh, oh, that's so sweet. Oh, I'm glad I looked at that. Oh no, so ungrieved. Something. Why would someone do that? Blah, blah blah. Right. Okay. So, oh, it's like a, it's a, it's a broken home. It definitely does look griefed. My goodness, Gracianius. Okay, we'll get out of here. See what else they've got. Wee. Oh, there's a love heart on that little house. There's so much to explore in this map. Grab a couple of friends, jump on. You will not be disappointed. Lots of little mini games, um, roller coasters, lots to do with your friends. What's this? That's another roller coaster. The Apple Store. <laughs> oh, that is amazing. <laughs> I like it how it's cold and clinical, just like a real one. <laughs> and one staff member, yup. <laughs> That's an Apple store for sure. Oh, <laughs> you've got your iPhone 7, 6S, 6 Plus, iPad, iPad Air. <laughs> Out of stock. <laughs> this is, wow, this is amazing. Charger cord, a lightning cable if it's Apple. Oh, wow. <laughs> that that's just made my day. They've got a good sense of humor as well, it seems. All right, so that's the Christmas theme park map. Now on to our first mod. So this is the Mind Gifts add-on. So you have uh, Santa. So Santa replaces the witch who is neutral until attacked. Uh, fair enough. I'm a bit the same. Um, and then if you do happen to kill Santa, he drops creeper spawn eggs and now creeper spawn eggs, um, are replaced by presents. So you break them and you get some sweet loot. So on that one, you can see I've got some iron ingots, some arrows and some, um, uh, bottles of enchanting. So I'll just open a few more because why not? Oh, a diamonds and a diamond sword, um, bones and a creeper head. Um, coal? Oh, <laughs> well, that's what I get for being greedy, I guess. So as you can see, creeper heads have been replaced by a present, so you can decorate your tree with them. Look, lovely little Christmas tree. So you don't need a texture pack or anything for that. And you just place some presents underneath the tree, Santa on it, why not? And then the cobweb replaces this, oh, sorry, the star replaces the cobweb. Um, apparently there are paintings, um, 
uh, lights as well, like Christmas lights, but I couldn't get that feature to work. So um, you might be able to on your device. It's just a matter of getting on and giving it a go. Now for our final uh, uh, showcase today, we've got Jimbo's Christmas weapons. Because when you've given all your friends the gifts and you've realized how good they are and you want to take them back, nothing says Christmas like being a Grinch. So the first one is the Christmas handgun. So it replaces the bow and shoots lollipops and its attack damage is 10. So I spawned in a heap of spiders so that I could give it a go. It's not very accurate as you can see. Um, but yeah, it's still pretty cool. And that's your little lollipop arrow. Uh, we'll just kill a few more spiders. Try and get that. No, it's not overtly accurate that <laughs> went way to the left okay so um what have we got here we've got the christmas spirit bottle so it replaces a snowball and it has a lingering healing effect lasting 20 seconds and then you have the Cr grinch anti-christmas bottle which replaces the egg it's a poisonous bottle and it lasts 20 seconds as well um as you can see they have both cute little uh, christmas hats and I'm just going to town poisoning all these spiders because spiders are the worst. And uh, last but not least, you have the a Christmas shotgun. So it replaces the fishing rod and it's meant to cause a lingering slowness effect for 20 seconds, um, which it seems to work on and off. Um, I haven't had the most success with it, but... Yeah, you might have a, a better, you might, I mean, in all honesty, I could be using this wrong. I just, I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> um, I'm not the best at um, using fishing rods in PvP. But there you have it. You've got your two maps, your two mods. Um, if you would like to um, download them, the links will be in the description below, as well as the link to the guy that built the um, theme park. Uh, if you like this video, hit the like button, comment down below and subscribe if you're new and I will catch you in the next video. Bye.